name is Manny Leota. And I'm Molly Pierkowski. Welcome to Media Tech News. Today you'll get an introduction to some of the big events going on in the CVCC Media Technology class. The seniors produced a commercial recently. Here's reporter Brandon Hartog. CVCC Media Technology seniors get to produce a commercial. Marketing and design specialist Jennifer Spear gave the Media Tech seniors an opportunity to produce a commercial for Cleveland-based UCX Brake Calibers. Producer Logan Pawlowski describes what working on a real client production can do for the students. I think that this project was a little nerve-wracking at first, but it was really a great project to allow people that um, don't normally get to work on things like this to kind of step out of their boundaries and gain a uh, real-life experience working with a real mar um, a professional marketing consultant and uh, it just allowed those students to you know like I said step out of their comfort zone and build confidence. Logan has worked on other client projects before but nothing this involved. Director Hallie Buddenhagen felt the pressure. It was a little nerve-wracking because I haven't really done a lot of real-life projects so um, I was a little nervous going into it, but in the end, it was really fun. Um, I had a great time, and it was a great experience. Media technology instructor Bernie Van Tilburg believes that client projects are an important part of education here at CVCC. I just think, you know, the client-based projects, it's really, it's really what we're about here at Cuyahoga Valley Career Center, to take stuff out of the classroom and put the students in a real-world situation, and that's what separates Cuyahoga Valley Career Center from a typical high school setup and give students a real advantage in the next step in their careers. UCX will show the commercial at the SEMA Car Show in Las Vegas, Nevada, November 3rd. Brandon Hartshock, Media Tech News. Students this year are a little upset. Hallie Buddenhagen tells us why. This year in Media Technology, students won't be able to update their desktop. The administration at CVCC thinks the backgrounds of the computer should be professional. This upsets some students. Media Tech senior Molly Pierkowski wants more than just a bland background. Changing it to something that we made to inspire us, I think we should be able to set it as to motivate us. I did screenwriting, so I kind of tried to make it look like a movie poster, and it took me about two days to make it. Senior Dave Testa also isn't happy about it. I do feel like what we have on our computer should be our choice, and I wish that like what I made for this project um, could be shown. I used like this old school like 50s font and I like, made that the sort of same green neon and then I wrote my name and what I wanted to do and then the three goals I had on the back and I think it turned out really good I just wish you know I could have used it. Senior Maggie Rendino worked very hard on her design. It took me a day and a half to get it to how I wanted it. The background was a film like a film photo. I did like individual photos of me, my friends, and then like the future colleges that I've been like looking at. Normally, Media Tech students have the ability to create their own backgrounds every year. Now they no longer can. Hallie Bun Higgin, Media Tech News. Luckily, students have found alternate ways to express creativity. They have been printing out their backgrounds and taping them onto their computers. Media Tech students once again thinking outside of the box. We're finishing today's broadcast with Donnie Scusa discussing a student that has been successful inside and outside of the classroom. Media Technology senior Logan Pawlowski started DJing when he was just 13. Busting Mode Entertainment, I started that in 2011. Our little motto is a DJ service for social gatherings and we do everything from providing DJ and music services for weddings, birthday parties, bar mitzvahs, um, pretty much anything you can think of that you want music for. Logan takes us back to humble beginnings. It started off being just family and friends and then from word of mouth people started seeing me at parties and um, my kind of client base has expanded. Most of our stuff is in the Cleveland Akron area. Logan is rising up the ranks of the music industry. And it really varies. Some years are really good. Some years are still good, but not as many. Um, I can estimate that I've done anywhere from 50 to 75 parties total. And then um, this year has been really good from the month of July through September. I think I did over 10. So whether you need a DJ or a videographer for your event, Logan is your guy. Donnie Scusa, Media Tech News. The students in Media Tech have been busy. It's definitely a great class to be a part of. 
You could take a look at everything we've been doing on our social media, facebook.com slash cvccmediatech and cvccmediatech.com. I'm Manny Leona. And I'm Molly Pierkowski. Thank you for watching. Thank you.